Hello and welcome to Straight to the Comments where we read the comment sections of tabloid news articles. Please stay to the end of the video to hear my opinion on this topic and of course let me know your opinion by leaving a comment. Please like and subscribe. A masks giving men a license to leer, women report a rise in aggressive eye contact since face coverings became commonplace as an expert, warns they provide anonymity for threatening behavior. Women online are reporting a rise in aggressive eye contact from men in masks. Social media users are sharing stories of so much hard staring happening. UN Women UK Executive Director said to be aware of anonymity masks provide. Claire Barnard told Female, we need to create an understanding that behavior like unwanted and persistent staring is intimidating. Women across the country are reporting a rise in aggressive eye contact since the introduction of face coverings in some public places. New laws introduced over the weekend force customers to wear face masks in all shops, stations, banks, and post offices, while it is also mandatory to wear coverings on public transport. But many women have been sharing stories online of aggressive eye contact and hard staring from men wearing masks, with one tweeting, grown men staring at you with a mask on is worse than when they don't have a mask. UN Women UK Executive Director Claire Barnard told Female, as we work to build back better following lockdown, we need to prevent the lack of witnesses of antisocial behavior due to less populated public spaces, as well as the anonymity face coverings can provide, leading to further rises in harassment and threatening actions towards women, girls and minoritized groups. This will require widespread changes in attitudes and behavior creating an understanding that behavior like unwanted and persistent staring is intimidating and that we all have a role to play in making our public spaces more inclusive. Women are complaining about a rise in intimidating behavior for men wearing masks, with many taking to social media to share their stories. One person commented, does anybody else feel like men are way more aggressively demanding eye contact in public? Since we all started wearing masks, so much hard staring happening, and I can't diffuse the attention by smiling like women are conditioned to do. It's weird. Another wrote, seriously, we all are wearing masks and some men still keep staring. WTF is wrong? Do men realize that masks don't cover their eyes, so we can still asterisk 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 see them staring like the creepy pieces of s asterisk 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 they are, one added. A jaunt downtown revealed men do not understand the anatomy of masks, another wrote. The masks do not cover your eyes. I can still see you staring, idiots. Claire told Female that the crisis continues to have a damaging effect on women's economic opportunities, social experiences and health, so it remains more important than ever that women can move freely through public space without intimidation, she explained, as part of our campaign to make the UK's public spaces safer and more inclusive for women and girls. We are hearing reports of rising harassment and threatening behavior in the streets and on transport, in addition to the clearly documented rising domestic abuse within the home. This can be particularly severe for women who also experience another intersecting minority characteristic, like women of color and differently abled people. Claire went on to say that it was important to be wary that the anonymity face masks provide, as well as the less populated spaces, don't lead to an increased rate of harassment for women. Masks have been compulsory on public transport since July 15, after evolving scientific advice suggested they could help stop covered sufferers without symptoms from spreading the disease. But over the weekend, new laws were introduced to make face coverings mandatory in shops, supermarkets and enclosed shopping centers as well as train stations, banks, post offices, building societies, bus stations and airports. Failure to comply could result in a £100 spot fine, although police forces have indicated they will only respond as a last resort. Scotland Yard said it hopes shoppers who refuse to wear masks will be shamed into compliance. 
a mask can only be removed in a shop for a small number of reasons, such as allowing staff to check someone's identity or age or to communicate with a deaf lip reader. Shop staff do not have to wear coverings, but it is strongly recommended that employers ask them to do so, unless they have other precautions such as screens. The new rules are contentious, with some people finding masks uncomfortable and some libertarians complaining they are being muzzled by the state. The best rated comment. Who have they been reporting this rise in aggressive eye contact to exactly? Nonsense story. What is aggressive eye contact? I think some women need to get over themselves. Wow as a woman I'm shocked. This is ridiculous stop with the constant man bashing men are not the enemy stop treating them as such and grow up. There is no such thing as aggressive eye contact. Oh. F.O. Another baseless case of male bashing point next you will be saying they are all white middle aged and privileged. Oh shut up. Here we go. There will be mass demonstrations about this now. Aggressive eye contact. Oh dear. Some people are just too precious. Maybe you should just stay indoors and scour social media for the next thing to be offended by. What a time to be alive. Aggressive eye contact. Is there literally nothing that people can't get offended by these days? What TF is aggressive staring? Stupid article. He looked at me. He looked at me. She squealed hysterically. What they really mean is the wrong guy was staring. Alternatively, the use of masks leads to increases in paranoia and histrionic behavior. Let's stop with the man hating for no reason. These women are so paranoid. Of course it is only the men's eyes they can see. I think most of these aggressive stares were purely psychological feelings these women had. Get a life. Women being stared at aggressively by males wearing FASA masks. With the very real problems we are facing at the moment, loss of incomes, COVID-19, curtailment of everyday freedoms and interactions that we have enjoyed in the past etc. This has got to be a joke. Beyond pathetic. I don't know whether to laugh or cry. The only thing showing our year eyes research was done by Karen. This is madness I just can't believe what's happening. Every day some other sh. T happens like this absolute bs. Aggressive eye contact. Have we reached peak stupidity yet? A great deal of our communication is non-verbal. People will look at others for longer as they no longer have a whole face to evaluate a person by. Social media users. The biggest bunch of bedwetters. Seriously what wacky feminist writes this verbal garbage? I had a pigeon stare at me longer than usual today with my mask on. Can we have an article about that tomorrow? Maybe one about my fish on Friday too? Oh, for Christ's sake. Give it a rest, will you? Bloody feminist rubbish. It covers the mouth not the eyes. Woman jumping on the Megan power trip bandwagon. Ha 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 ha. I must say, it has been quite challenging wolf whistling with these masks on. When will this BS end? What a sad society we've become. Aggressive I can tat what the hell is that? Seems the open season on all men continues. Acute paranoia. The day will come when you will not even be noticed. So, enjoy the non-touch. Furtive looks, they will not last. We are only days away from just being white, male and middle aged, will be an arrestable offense. Poor old men, now in trouble for just looking. Glad I'm a female, I can do anything a man can do, but I don't end up in court. Aggressive eye contact, honestly get a grip people. What a completely useless article this is. Let's just simply blame all men for absolutely everything wrong with a woman's life. Why don't we all just cover every part of our heads, so that we don't look at anyone, don't breathe, don't hear, 
that will sort it out. I'll tell you something for nothing, all women like it, when a man pays attention to them, in a respectful way of course. It's high time this stupidity stopped. The worst rated comments. I sometimes stare at people in masks, because it amazes me the level on obedience and lack of critical thinking in the general population. In times of crisis the true face of men emerges. Your eyes do convey messages, they are not for nothing called, the window to your soul I'm glad I have nice green eyes, nicer than brown, and not cold, like blue, or grey. Well yes, some of this is true I'm afraid. Actually if you look back in history women used to cover in such a way as to let the men's imagination take over. Very alluring without being raunchy. The in your face here I'm of today was considered a loose woman back then. So covering your face has much the same effect. The male is trying to realize what the mask has cloaked underneath. In all societies women are conditioned into being the passive recipients of the active observer's stare and the observers are always men. When women realize that this is wrong and decide to become the observe men get confused and either think you are trying to make eyes at them or that you are mad. Personally I like to add a loud tut or just audible yuck when passing with my death stare to act as confirmation of my innate psychopathy which seems to work quite well in deterring the poor staring souls from any further delusion. I sometimes accompany this with the queen's wave depending on the severity of the delusion. We are in Spain and it's hot. They are do uncomfortable and sweaty. No one is wearing the cotton type everyone is wearing the disposable breathable version as they are light and more comfortable. He was trying to look at my fovea spot. Why are so many men pathetic? I don't mind blokes having a quick glance, but I had a bus driver, on a break stare at me as I walked up the pavement then turned round and continued to stare as I walked past. I told him to take a picture as it would last longer. He had the decency to look embarrassed. Yes, this really is a thing. The aggressive stare isn't going to be leveled at middle-aged plump ladies with graying hair, but at young attractive and good figured girls. Unfortunately men have never been great at subtle communication. So they think that having their face covered they can leer, and get away with it. Or forget that, and full on eye, glare is used instead. Masking up is weird for our race and our country, so men bless em think they have found a new way, to ogle slash stare with their face coverings, but we can still see their eyes lure. Even if a woman has shorts on and a vest a man should not ogle a girl. Especially if he's an older man. That's even worse. So a girl of 20 who is scantily clad, being ogled by a 40 year old is not right. Not in 21st century UK. Basically a girl or a woman has the right to wear what she wants, and is channeling her freedom from those dark days when judges who are let's face it downright unattractive mostly used to say she was asking for it. Look how. Biggest thing to me on this issue, is what if I were to meet a pretty pretty young lady at least she looked very pretty, but she had a mask on, but then let's say I took her out to dinner, and she removed her mask, and she had those British teeth then what am I obligated to stay for dinner? Yes, and this is why, face coverings are not right, I don't care what the arguments are, we are a species, that need face to face contact. Every emotion, love, hate, fear and downright ordinary recognition comes through our facial expressions. We are now slowly becoming quite literally a faceless society. I was in BNQ and an old boy in a blue boiler suit and slicked back hair had a mask on. He looked exactly like Hannibal Lecter from Silence of the Lambs. Come to think of it, he was looking at masking tape. When he looked up at me, I dropped my pot plant. I was walking home from the shops the other day carrying bags of food shopping. Two grown men in their 40s drove by me and shouting obscenities. Have a word hey? It angered me so much. It needs to stop. The most recent comments. Prolonged eye contact is a natural consequence of the reduced social cues 
that are visible with the face partially covered. There is nothing aggressive about it. Misunderstandings are perhaps a natural consequence of this. Get over it. Better start wearing dark glasses than guys. I know, men should all walk around blindfolded, so no eye contact. Damn, won't work because, when they bump into a woman they'll be accused of groping her, it's just a lose-lose situation chaps. Longer eye contact is a natural effect of the reduced social cues, that are perceived due to a partial face covering. Misunderstandings are a natural result of this. Is it women on a push bike who are reporting this strange behavior, or are they just called Karen? Don't wear revealing clothing, then. The solution is in your own hands. Oh please quit the man-hating. If it wasn't for men, and women, we wouldn't be here. Be thankful. And when these same women hit 40 or so, they'll complain men ignore them, because they're not young and pretty anymore. They're no longer valued, or old and alone except for the companionship from their cats. They'll cry on social media they've been ripped off by Nigerian con artist preying on post-menopausal women. Young women will sympathize with them, maybe set up a GoFundMe, and the cycle continues wash, rinse, repeat. Aggressive eye contact. Grow up pathetic little snowflakes, and FYI I'm a woman. Give me strength. Aggressive eye contact. Now I've heard it all. Get a grip, a stare cannot hurt you. As a wise man once said, being a feminist doesn't make one an expert. I've read a lot of made up stories here, and this is right up amongst the best. Don't tell the government they'll make it illegal, and fine you 100, if you don't comply. There are some super masks out there, some lovely designs. Maybe those men in question, are staring at those and wondering, I wonder where she got that one from. Oh for goodness sake get a grip. Sounds as if the perpetually offended brigade are at it again. Now this is funny. Okay, so looking at a woman is now threatening behavior. Here we go. It's always only men. Oh come on. What's aggressive eye contact, utter drivel. I was in Tescas the other day and a woman in a mask, was staring at my large sausage I had in my hand. What a load of tripe, everyone is staring at each other like lepers, and acting like complete lunatics. Paranoid yes everyone is, masks are evil. Ha 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 ha. What's next? Ban men. No, they aren't staring at you, they are looking, the same as you did to see them. Oh for f's sake, do people just wake up, and go looking for things to upset them, or to get offended by? Rubbish. These dumbs in DM having a slow day looks like. Some people have some weird nonsense going on in their heads. Lmao was a load of garbage. When I walk around in public showing off my manhood, in tight skimpy shorts, and my hairy chest on show, women look at me, and I love it. My dearly departed mother accused someone on the tube of ogling her once, the laughter on the tube, when he stood up, and unfolded his white stick lived with her for a very long time. I swear, his eye was waving it slashes at me angrily, sigh. If men are staring it is, because we see other humans so rarely now, since we are not allowed to go out, go to work, go to the mall, be social, have dates, etc. Seeing another person especially one of the opposite sex is a rarity these days. Kind of like seeing a unicorn. Please. WTF. Just when you think you have heard it all. This says so much more about the complaining women than it could ever say about the men. Can't win point stop wearing those see through masks. Thanks for the support ladies, it's appreciated and as someone commented we are our sons, brothers, fathers, husbands and we all want to live in a safe environment. 
Guys don't look at each other, or you'll get a fine. Snowflake much? Rolls eyes. Is it April the 1st already? I'm a woman, what the hell have we got eyes for? Up. Uh. Seriously, aggressive eye contact? Lol, really? So these women must really hate sunglasses. Is this a serious thing? That is honestly too funny an aggressive stare, because of masks for ha 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 ha. I think I've noticed a rise in women staring aggressively at men. Can we get this documented about as well lol? Glad they can't see my open mouth tongue wagging, as long as they're focused on my eyes. Lol. Oh come on. Haven't experienced this yet. Starting to think women just want something to complain about in regards to men. That concludes the video. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Personally I think this is quite silly, it takes two people to have eye contact, aggressive or any other kind, just look away. What do you think? Have you experienced this, I haven't. Please like and subscribe for 4 videos a week.